The Montre Corum Sarl, commonly referred to as Corum, was founded in Le Chaux de Fonds, Switzerland by Gaston Rice and his nephew, René Banwart, in 1955. Almost a year later, they started to produce their first line of luxury watches. However, it wasn't until 1960 that the company's first claim to fame was introduced. Which brings me to the topic of today's video. I will be going over the introduction and history of the legendary Admiral's Cup watch. Essentially, the Admiral's Cup watch is a nod to the Admiral's Cup regatta, which was first held in 1957 and ran through 2003. The race was an international yachting competition organized by the Royal Ocean Racing Club and known as the unofficial world championship of offshore racing, located in the town of Cowes in southern England. There is actually plenty of history attached to the Admiral's Cup watch. Primarily a sports watch when first launched, the first Admiral's Cup watch had little to do with the current models. It was square, water resistant, and had a sailboat engraved on its back. Over time, the watch evolved, eventually featuring a recognizable 12-sided dodecagonal case made of various materials through the years, including stainless steel, rose gold, yellow gold, two-tone, and titanium too. The dial design proudly features 12 brightly colored nautical pennants representing the 12 flags of the International Code of Signals, or ICS. The International Code of Signals is a means of communication for naval ships in situations when language difficulties arise. With a pre-established standardized alphabet, which they've created along with the spoken form of each letter, the alphabet is matched to agreed standardized flags. These flags are assigned as codes for various standardized messages to communicate when needed. After decades of evolution, Quorum has offered a diverse array of Admiral's Cup models to choose from. After all, the Admiral's Cup watch is Quorum's longest running watch line, still continuing today with the Quorum Admiral 38 for ladies, the 42 and 45 watches. The current line of watches feature the traditional 12-sided case, automatic movements with a variety of complications, and nautical pennants on the dial. Since Corm's beginning in 1955, the Swiss brand has continuously been developing luxury timepieces that are exceptionally well made. The immense popularity and legendary status already bestowed upon the Admiral's Cup collection has helped create this iconic timepiece. I hope you enjoyed the video today. If you did, make sure to give it a like, and if you'd like to see more content from us, you can subscribe right here. And as always, if you need any help repairing your watch, the link to our website is right here. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.